first to fire at a home in Jamesburg, New Jersey, believed to have claimed two lives, and authorities fear there may be somebody missing. News Cop to 7 is high above the scene. Eyewitness News reporter Derek Waller is on the ground in Jamesburg. Let's begin with Derek. Sandra Ken, good morning to you. And as the sun comes up, we're getting a better look at the extensive damage to this house. You can see Newscopter 7 on the scene here as well, here on Sheridan Street in Jamesburg. And uh, the roof of this home is just about completely gone. Extensive damage is what firefighters saw when they got here around 3.30 in the morning. I believe we have some video from earlier to show you as well. A little while ago, you can see the front of that house is heavily damaged. And again, they came here about 3.30 in the morning on Sheridan Street in Jamesburg. And uh, when they got here, they saw heavy fire uh, conditions inside that home. Uh, uh, two people inside were found dead in the house, and then a third person is still unaccounted for. Uh, we can tell you so many family members are out here sitting outside in the cold waiting for any news. Right now, the fire marshal's office is here investigating a possible cause. And just a few minutes ago, we spoke to a neighbor who told us what he saw this morning. My dog started barking and looked out. My window is literally right next to the house. Like you can see the inside of the house from where I am, and it just is completely leveled. Is a, you could just feel the flames like through the window on your face. And so we are hoping to get an update uh, on this situation from a fire official coming up this morning. Again, two people dead, a third person unaccounted for. And for more on this, we're going to go up to Newscopter 7 and John Del Giorno. John. And Derek, as you mentioned, there's heavy damage visible here on the roof. The firefighters got here at 3.30 this morning, and they're describing a heavy volume of fire that they found upon arrival. This looks like it was a one-story house with a maybe half-story attic, and you can plainly see here where that blaze burned up and through the roof. We just saw a few minutes ago fire department investigators walking through the house. They began in the front door. They walked all the way through. They walked to the rear. Middlesex County prosecutor is on the scene here. It will be their job to determine the cause of this blaze. As you said, two bodies found in the house, a third person still unaccounted for at this hour.